0-0. And the Blackhawks come up looking for the first. There it is. Big pad save. Off the left pad of Perry Price. Cross got to center. Cross dumps it in. Canadian's fourth line. Moving up on the play is Cornival. Went after it. Got over in front of the net. Cornival in the blue ice in front. The shot stopped. Crawford hangs on. Chance at both ends. I think the better chance by the Canadians. You know what? Quindell loves to rub the... Harris saw his shot. That'll be blocked. Zod fell. Tried to make a pass back. Did get it back to the line. On to Duncan Keith and back to him. Anzu shot it behind the Montreal net. Murray is back there moving on it. Douglas Murray, number six. Took his man. The buck was loose. The Canadians in a little trouble by the looks of it. Can't get the puck ahead. It's stopped and knocked down by Versteeg. No shot. In behind the net. It'll come back out to Keith. Put it in a way wide of the net, hoping for a deflection. It didn't happen. And Rafael Diaz. Flipped it ahead and that was giveaway. Kept in by Hanzo. Pass in front of the net coming. Seabrook had a stick up in time. But the Canadians let it loose in their own zone with the Chicago Blackhawks ever dangerous. And they jump on a puck so quickly. Why they're so high in the standings. That's why everybody is ready for Blackhawks when they come to town. They score a lot of goals, but I'll tell you what, they're really responsible in the neutral zone. Look at this, 1-2-2. Two, two. They're going to wait you out, and they're inviting you to come right into their web, and then they're going to jam you in this neutral zone and turn it over, and they transition as good as anybody, Greg. And if you ever do get through the web, then you better make sure you put the pucks in an area where you can get them back, because the Hawks are terrific at entering the zone one pass, and they're out.